Hello everyone, Smox here from Celebrant Quest. I am a registered civil marriage celebrant in Australia, which means that I love love, but I also love playing video games. And today we are back in Baldur's Gate 3. I am playing a Dark Urge Bard. And uh, we are about to approach Auntie Ethel and her friends. So let's get into it. Lads, for the love of all that is holy, I've never clapped eyes on your poor sister. Oh, God. Drop the act, hag. You was the last to see me, Rena. Just let her go. Please. Thank goodness you're here, sweetie. I, I don't know what's come over I these boys. I don't know what's come over these boys either. Stop this. We won't ask again. How about you all just calm down? What's going on here? Lower your weapons. I know this lady. This has nothing to do with me. Goodbye. But just because she's an old woman in a swamp, she's a hag. Lay off the fairy tales, lads. I think we're going to go with just everyone calm down. What's going on? Careful. Don't trust the word out of her mouth. It's not nice. Our sister went to the hag and we ain't seen her since. Hand over heart, I don't know their sister. I will gladly help you all look for her, though. Enough. Where is she? I won't let you hurt Auntie Ethel. I'm not getting involved. Ethel, what did you do? I'm not... I won't let you hurt Auntie Ethel. Sweetie, be careful! She, she's with the hag! Don't bloody stand there gaping! Get her! Oh, gosh. Alrighty. Well, here we go. All right, let's just dispatch these guys. Oh, my stars. I, my stars. I didn't mean for this to happen. What happened? It sounded like a heated argument. Do you know this Marina they mentioned? The best thanks are to be paid in gold. I think I'll just say what happened. It sounded like a heated argument. Those poor boys were looking for their little sister, Marina. The girl who's staying with me this is all my fault so you did but know I her made a promise Marina begged me not to breathe the word if they came looking for her and my word is my bond that poor thing would be distraught we can't let her know it would break her poor heart I'd best get going but please stop by my house I'd like to thank you proper I suspect we've been played for fools. Yeah, because she just went off in a puff of smoke. <laughs> Dear John and Delmere, oh sorry, Demir, don't get mad. I mean it. I'm only leaving this note so you don't panic and do something stupid. I'm going to the hag. I owe it to Connor to make things right. You know he did the same for me. I'll be back soon, so not a word to ma'am, all right? She has enough on her plate, Marina. So the hag did know her. All right, let's keep going. Wish I had a bag of holding. Ooh, traps. All right, let's disarm those. Oh, a teddy. A worn note splattered with mud attached to a doll. It was clearly written in a hurry. Hold this every time you miss mummy, baby. And don't and do not leave camp. Back soon. That's really sad. Alright, let's see what else is in this swamp. Oh, what's this? A loving note. A chill runs up your spine. Oh. You feel like you're being watched. Investigation. Look for anything out of the ordinary or ignore the feeling. Let's investigate. Need a 20. That's not going to happen. Nope. <laughs> the place has a quiet sense of calm. You can't see anything strange. Oh, well, if I can't see anything strange, there mustn't be anything strange, right? <laughs> T 
take a breather, lovelies, and have a bite to eat on me, Auntie E. Okay, that doesn't sound ominous at all. Juicy apple. Oh, that's poisoned. All right, let's just leave those alone, shall we? On my way. A trap. Someone doesn't like visitors. Okay, what's going Wait. on with the sheep? The sheep's voice warbles. You realize it's trying to say bar. It's trying to say. Uh, drop your eyes and carefully reach up, boo or leave. Let's go with animal handling. 15. I'll be, oops, no. <laughs> Wheezing, the sheep backs away. That's not weird at all. <laughs> okay. Let's go to camp and we'll rest. Maybe it'll bring us closer. Here's my little treat with their cheeks <laughs> all flushed. You will come to my bed tonight. Oh. <laughs> won't you? You don't have to ask twice. A little treat? You can do better than that. Very presumptuous. I'm undecided. I think it's better if we leave last time as a once-off. Uh, a little treat? You can do better than that. Oh, I certainly can. It would be my pleasure. Hmm. How about this one? When I'm with you, I feel <laughs> practically alive. Yet I crave only to die again with you. <laughs> That's so corny. Mm, keep going. So many honeyed words as usual. Is that the best you can do? Let's go with, is that the best you can do? Hmm. Let me give it another go. Every part of your perfect body whispers temptation. It's as if the gods made you just to ruin me. <laughs> That's a good one. And what else? You're sweet and sillier than I thought. Did this really work on Kazador's targets? Why would you bring up Kazador? I'm going to go with you're sweet and sillier than I thought. <laughs> I can go all night with the flattery. But is that really all you want? No, it's not really all that How I want. about if I said these little words? Everyone's favourite. Mm -hmm. I love you. Uh, what? You'd be lying. A little too soon to say that, don't you think? Having fun, are you? I don't want to say you'd be lying, because I feel like he would know. And a little too soon, that's really just discounting his feelings. I tend to err on the side of caution that people who say that are probably telling the truth. I might go with having fun, are you? I feel like it's the least egregious of the lot. Oh, hope he's not mad. I'm going to go with having fun, are you? <laughs> I am. It's hard not to. Oh, okay. Seems okay about it. Now, as much as I relish standing around and saying all my favourite lines at you... I'd much rather at we got you. to experience each other's uh, full portfolio of talents once again. <laughs> I'll come and find you after everyone is asleep. I'm sure you will get another chance soon, but not right now. I don't think I really want this. 
Oh, that's so good. I feel like he really took that as like a, he's having fun and maybe he feels comfortable to say those things. That's great. Let's say I'll come and find you when everyone else is asleep. I'll be waiting. I'm sure you will. Mm, okay, nice little, little much ado about nothing there. I hoped you would come. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I have missed you. And now you're all mine. And I'm all yours. Until morning, at least. Let's see where the night takes us. <laughs> Let's. <laughs> okay. Let's keep going. Oh, a waypoint. That's awesome. That means I can go and sell my stuff and then come back. All right, I'll do that real quick. Um, oh, here's a path up here. Let's try this. Oh, who's it? Gandrel? Hmm. Ah, stranger. Forgive the aroma. Hi. You catch Ew. a waft of something <laughs> foul, metallic, and sickly. Have you got a musk as well? <laughs> Powdered iron vine. An old hunter's trick. Most monsters will think twice before making a meal of me. You're a monster hunter. I'm surprised. I thought all girl were vagrant cutthroats. Why is Astarian so interested in this? That's weird. Uh, say nothing? Pardon, but who or what is a girl? I knew you were a jackass, but a racist? I'm shocked. Wh who's that to? To Astarian? Oh my god, ignore the elf. He talks too much. What the hell? Um, I th I'm going to say nothing. If he wants to lead the conversation, let him go. And more. We steal chickens, curse your crops, seduce your daughters, the list goes on. Oh, I wish I had half the power settled folk think my people possess. Alas, I am a simple wanderer. A simple wanderer and monster hunter. But I'm no witch doctor or cutthroat. So what monsters are you hunting? If I were a cutthroat, I wouldn't admit it either. Yeah, I wouldn't. I wouldn't admit it. True. And I have no proof to offer but my word. If you wish it, our paths need not cross again. I'm hunting a vampire spawn. A what? It's a little too bright for you to be my prey. His name is Astar. Uh... <gasps> but I fear he's gone to ground. What I the? I hope the hag of these lands can help me flush him out. If I can afford her blood price. Her blood price? What the hell? And when you find this Astarian, you'll kill him? Only a spawn? Pity not like it's a real vampire. Time for us to go. Good luck with your quest. Oh my god. Well, here he is. This is Astarian. Oh my god, I'm not selling him out. And when you find Astarian, you'll kill him? Not this time. My orders are to capture him. Oh. Uh, and bring him where, exactly? Baldur's Gate. My people wait for me there. Oh, okay, only a spawn. Time for us to go. Well, this here it is. Here's a Starian. I think I'll go with only a spawn. Pity it's not like a real vampire. <laughs> Just give him a little bit of a tease. <laughs> I don't know. I'm sure a vampire spawn could still rip out your throat if he felt like it. <laughs> he is right, unfortunately. <laughs> they are only weak when compared to their masters. During the day, we have the advantage. But at night, when they hunt, you'll not find a more deadly quarry. Uh-huh. Yes, I'm sure they can creep right up on you. <laughs> Interesting. Asarian, what do you think? Thank you for warning. We'll be careful. Um, I'm going to ask Astarian what he thinks. That's Astarian. <gasps> oh, my God. No. No, I mean, I meant... Impossible. Oh, my gosh. These days, I'm making the impossible look easy. I thought I thought yeah. I would just say it to him, not in front of that guy. May I? Yes, nod. Yes, you can. Excellent. <gasps> Here we go. Vampire. It can't be. Well, it is, buddy. All right, let's take out this guy. Oh, 
Oh, damn you. <gasps> oh, shut her up. Choice. A star in skill serves oh. well. <gasps> A sage choice indeed. I was never going to sell him out. No way. Oh my god. What have we got? Gandril's aspiration. Ooh. I wonder if Lazel can use that one. Is that blood? Let's talk to no. Astari and see no. what he thinks about that. Hello, my sweet. So there's a monster hunter after you. Mm. Not anymore. <laughs> Which is all that matters, really. I guess so. But why was he hunting you? What did you do? That's not very nice. What if there are others? He might not have been alone. The next time someone comes looking for you, you're on your own. No way. I'm going to say he might not have been alone. Oh, there'll be others. I'm sure of that. If Cazador sent one peon after me, he'll send another. You're sure Cazador's behind this? It was bad enough running for the Mind Flayers. Now your past is chasing us too? I would never say that. We'll go with Cazador. It was him, I'm sure. Only he would know to send the Gur after me. It was a group of Gur that attacked me that night in Baldur's Gate. I would have died had <gasps> Cazador not appeared and saved me. Oh, I see. Saved you by turning you into a vampire slave? You can't hold every Gur responsible for what happened to you. So why send one after you now to remind you of that night? He appeared just when he needed him. That's convenient. Why would Monster Hunter serve Cazador? He's a vampire. Mm, let's say that was convenient. Maybe. Maybe he was just drawn to the smell of blood. The point is, I have history with these barbarians. Cazador's sending a message. He's reminding me of his power. Even in the middle of nowhere, he can reach me. And he wants me back. But why capture you? Why not just kill you? Don't worry, you're safe with me. How concerned should we be? I want to tell him that he's safe with me, but I do want to know how concerned we should be. Concerned? Do you know the power a vampire lord possesses? He can change shape, turn into mist, call walls to do his bidding, shrug off blows like they're nothing. He could walk into our camp tonight and kill you with his bare hands. And you'd be lucky if death was the worst thing that happened to you. All right, what do you suggest? He can do that. Uh, don't be naive. Vampires aren't invincible. We could take him. Let's just ask what he suggests. First, we have to... Uh, 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 I don't know. Well, if we kill his lackeys, he'll just send more. We just have to be vigilant. Keep our wits about us. And kill any monster hunters on sight. Okay. Interesting. Alright, God. Can't believe someone just brazenly came to try to kill a Starian. Oof. Swift as my feet can carry me. Alright, so when will I actually get to fight? Fight. See, Auntie Ethel. I'm guessing it's going to be a fight with Auntie Ethel. So it looks like that's her house there. That is cute as hell. I'm just a little worried about... Oh, look, there's a well. I'm just a little worried about the fact that Astarian has no health. So let's see if I can short rest him. Just a brief respite. I think that's fine. Never a dull moment. Doesn't look good, man. If she's a magic lady, I don't know. <laughs> what's around here? Can we go down the well or anything? Oh, what's up here? Oh, this is pretty. Greater healing potion. Who's in here? Oh, God. Yeah, for sure. Oh, my gosh. Look at this. Look how cool this is. Wait, what was that? Oh, who's that? Mayrena. May oh, there's Auntie Ethel. So she is 
here. No one stopped me yet. All right. Fresh, sweet-smelling water gurgles gently below. Oh, uh, do I want a drink? I don't know. The warm rush of power flows through you. You feel stronger, faster, better. Do we? What's that buff? Refreshed. Hit point maximum increased by 10 until the nut. What? <gasps> Can we all do that? Oh, enough waiting. I crave Let's blood. all do it. Fresh, sweet smelling water gurgles gently below. The warm rush of power. Oh my god, she's got it too. Watch your Everyone's bird. doing it. Holy dooly. What to do? <laughs> uh, well, I think that kind of indicates that there's going to be something going on, right? I don't know if we should go in the front door or what. Oh, we are going in the front door. There's cute bunting and everything. Okay, let's go in. I'm quite nervous. My face protects me. Can't give up now. Another step forward. Oh god, I'm quite nervous. I don't want a crumb left on that plate, girl. Auntie Ethel, please. One more bite and this pie is gonna come back up to say hello. Oh shit. Don't make me get the wooden spoon. You're eating for two, so get to it. Oh my god. Oh, if it isn't my hero. You took ages. Come in, come in. Feel free to relax yourself and have a cuppa. Hmm? Okay. Gods grant me patience. Eat up, Marina. I won't say it again. Oh my god. She looks like she's having a great time. <laughs> That's Marina. I have some bad news for her. No, Auntie Ethel. <laughs> Auntie Ethel knows about the bad news. You have an interesting home. I'm glad you got here safely. Do you treat all your guests so poorly? You said you had something for the parasite. You have an interesting home. Beautiful, isn't it? Is it is actually. It's my little refuge for the lost and hopeless. Oh, well, that's us. <laughs> People in dire need travel from all over Faerun to see little old me. And I do my damnedest to help them. Well, that's lovely. And you, Petal. Well, you need a lot of help. Yes, I do. That wriggler swimming in your brain juice is a bit of an inconvenience, isn't it? Are you saying you can remove it? I'm dealing with it. Something isn't right. That woman, why is she with you? Uh, are you saying you can remove it? Quicker than you can say yes, auntie. <laughs> what do you say? Want me to take care of the little bugger? Oh god, am I gonna lose my other eye? <laughs> I know a devil that's offered to remove it. Oh, I wonder what she would say about that. Depends on the price. Yes, get it out of me. I'll take my chances. Um... What does she say about the devil? A devil? <laughs> Spare me. Blathering windbags in love with the sound of their own voices. <laughs> I'm the safer bet. Plus, You'll get to keep your soul. That sounds good. Um, yeah, I get that it's out of me. My, I do like the meat. <laughs> but know that I don't work for free. I expect payment up front. One of your pretty little peepers. Um. Oh dear, you don't have one to spare. <laughs> Terribly sorry, Petal. But no deal for you. Should you know someone with two eyes in their head and a regular problem, send them my way. Auntie will sort them out. There's three others in my party. Hello. I'm sure Lazel will begrudgingly take the L. Come now, Marina. Time to go. Oh, what? What was that voice? I can just walk into home. Oh, that's great. This gets better and better. Where did she go? Maybe I need more pockets. 
just walk into homes now. Yeah, right. I'm glad you're feeling better. Rosary flames. Hiding a passage. Oh. Where does it lead? Should we be looking into that? Maybe. Let's just see what else we can kind of purloin while we're here first. <laughs> gold oh, she wanted one of my eyes damn well because Rolo had a good go <laughs> all right let's um let's go and check where this went Gosh, oh, there's Auntie Ethel. She wasn't there a second ago. Keep your distance, darling. <sighs> no one back home will ever believe this. Hello, sweetness. I'm still waiting for someone with a spare eye. What happened to Marina? I'm here to trade. Oh. Get rid of all our shit. Can I ask her about Marina? I have something to ask. Hello, sweet. I'm still waiting for someone. Keep your own little nose in your own little dish petal. I don't like busybodies. Okay. Ta ta, petal. What if I talk to her with, say, Lazel? Indolence breeds madness. She's got two eyes. Sweet, you going to give me one of those precious peepers? You want one of my eyes? Why? Will my sight be damaged? Uh, yeah, let's do it. You have a deal. Glorious. Oh my god, I did it with what this. Moment? And she needs her real nails for this. Her real nails? Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh dear, what she turned into. <gasps> oh, she's beautiful. Uh-oh. Uh Uh-oh, what's happened? Oh dear. better that human skin is fierce restrictive oh my god is this her backbone <laughs> so the brothers were right you are a hag githyanki what in all spinning planes are you cute am i supposed to be impressed give me run reason why i shouldn't cut you down am i supposed to be impressed well yes I should bloody think so. <laughs> Not many get to see a hag in all her glory. Consider yourself blessed. Mm, okay. Now choose which eye will it be, right or left? Mm, the left eye. Hold on to your knickers. <laughs> this might sting a bit. Oh my god. Was this the right choice? <laughs> Oh no. <gasps> She's got it. It's not going to work, is it? No. That wasn't so bad, was it? Check that your eye is still there. Say nothing. Belly felt it, actually. Belly felt it, actually. <laughs> oh, you do make me laugh. No. Unless you want tentacles for a tongue, stay absolutely still. Oh my gosh. I've removed one of these buggers before, but it's a touch tricky. The parasite squirms at the hag's words. Pain builds behind your eye. 
You feel the creature writhe as it's dragged towards your ear. Oh my then God. it bites back, burrowing even deeper into your brain. Oh no. Oh! What happened? Goddamn wretched! You little shit! <laughs> you didn't tell me it was Nethery's! I'm not touching that! Oh my gosh. What does that mean? <laughs> uh, Nethery's? Filthy shadow magic! Brings nothing but chains and misery. How could I have missed that stink? Like blood and piss congealing on my tongue. Ugh. Someone's <laughs> tampered with your parasite. That's likely why you've not turned yet. Oh my gosh, what do you mean tampered? I thought you could remove it. All the more reason to remove it or else. What do, what do you mean? Bless us. You're as slow as a wet week. That thing has been touched by more than mind flayers. You're a dead soul walking. I can't help you. Oh my gosh, a dead soul walking? Hag-eyed. What about my eye? What does hag-eyed mean? Dealing with hags always comes with a cost. In this case, an eye. Oh my god, Lisa, look at her eye. Like It's like either not there or something, but it's green. Um... Which is your way of saying I'm you're not powerful enough. Yeah, I reckon. I'd kill you for that. But why deny your regular the pleasure? But let it not be said that Auntie Atle doesn't honor her debts. Here, it's on you to fix yourself. Now get out! Tab Ready at your unusual course of the infliction. Auntie Ethel's Auntie Ethel's charm. Where has she gone, I wonder? Lysel, what happened to your eye, dude? Okay, so your eye's a bit screwed up. Uh, <laughs> sorry about that. Paid the price. Oh. Oh. When it when attacking ha okay, that's fine. Um Okay. I have a lot on my mind. And well, in it. Right, so what are we supposed to do? Just be expected to just, what, leave now? Yes, darling. I thought vampires couldn't walk into homes without an invitation. We can't. And yet I cross the threshold like moonlight through leaves. This worm is a powerful little beast, isn't it? Sounds like you're enjoying it. <laughs> What's not to enjoy? I can walk in sunlight, trespass upon any home, manipulate minds. I'm the most powerful vampire in the realms. <laughs> Granted, the looming doom is an issue, but why not enjoy the benefits while we can? For sure. What does Shadowheart have to say? Shah's blessings upon you. You seemed intrigued when Halsa mentioned Dark Justicias before. I was. He mentioned Dark Justicias, and we've come across other signs of a Sharon presence during our travels. I'm not sure I can dismiss that as a coincidence. Mm hmm. What about Lazelle? She's gonna get up me, isn't she, for sacrificing her eye? Speak. No. She just literally has no bother about it. All right, let's um. Oh, it, the way is open, is it? Let's see what this does. Wooden stairs. Moving ahead. One hundred and twenty XP. How close are we to leveling up? Oh, a lot, <laughs> a lot further than I thought. Well, there's only one thing for it. Let's go. Okay. 
overgrown tunnel. More for me. Let's move. Huh. Pouch. Who's that? Magron. Magron's head. <gasps> Don't look. What is going on? Stop. Please. Please. Who's that? Lauren. Are you holding your own skull? Don't look. Don't. Don't look at what? Why is the mini map red? Oh. Oh no. Don't look. Don't. You are as thick as they come, sweetness. Uh oh. This is my personal playhouse, and you don't have an invite. Get out! Tell me where Marina, Marina is. I think I'll stay a while. Or what? Let's say or what? Oh, the cocky ones are my favourite to chew on. Keep going, Pickle, and you'll find out. <laughs> oh. God. Oh no. Where is she? Don't look. Amira? Don't. What? As you edge closer to the mirror, a pale face appears, contorted in fear. Fists slam against the mirror's surface again oh. and again. Oh my god, is somebody trapped in there? My sweet Callum, whose beloved asked that his beauty never fade. My sweet Callum. What's that? Oh. What is this place? Entrance gallery? My darling Magrin. She wished for the mind of a genius, but that silly head crossed me. Oh my god. So why Ephron? Family portrait. Nolly Cauldron? No? Alright, no. A whispering mask. Look. Don't Oh, were you in love with yourself or something, Lauren? Stop. Please. Please. No. No. Don't look. Mustn't look. Mustn't see. Are you all right? Mustn't look at what? Tut, tut. This maggot should end him. Are you all right? I see it. What's to come? You realize there's magic at work. Some type of spell. An illusion. Me. Dead, dead, flesh rotten, bone shining. Oh God. Quietly observe, calm yourself. Whatever you're seeing, it isn't real. I just see your reflection. Hey, look at me. What are you doing? Get out of here. I'm gonna observe him. Skull splitting, knife twisting, gut spilling. All future, all bad, all. Gods, don't hurt me. Oh, please, please. Please, please, please! What? Why would I hurt you? You're safe with me, I swear. Every time you open your mouth, it gets a little more tempting. No! No! Monster! Why don't you just end it for him? Oh, mind dripping! Flesh peeling! Mind flare! Oh my god, you can see that? Take a deep breath and roar. I'm something much worse. No intention of letting that happen. 
away. Away. I wonder. Don't look. Don't spill some blood. Oh. You feel crushing waves of fear as the presence within the door recoils. It can't let people through. Not again. Hold the door. Hold on. Ah, uh, what happened last time you opened? Come on, open up. No time to chat and Peter kill the hag. The scene appears in your mind. Two paladins and a cleric marching through the door. Oh dear. Shrouded in the glow of the divine. Tear? Weapons brandished, they charge into the hag's lair. Screams of terror pierce the air. You let them in? Nobody. That's a decade for each. You're mine for 30 more years, Pekka. Oh. I mean it, let me through. Alright, is there another way in? The hag will be the least of your problems if you don't open up. Alright, is there another way in? You see an image of blue skies and sunshine as the door shudders a warning. Run. Come on. Intimidation, I will kill here today. It can be you or it can be the hag. If I kill the hag, you'll be free. Let's go with the intimidation. Hey, we don't have bloodless. The door shudders, imagining its wooden frame cracking and splintering in a raging inferno. You see the hag. She walks through the door, its form shimmering. With a jerk, you're pulled from the vision. You feel the presence within shrink, terrified. Stop. Please. I'm trying to put you Please. out of your misery. I think that's probably the for the best, mate. Blood. You seemed very upset. No, never mind. <laughs> Not bad. Well, I've had better days. And worse ones. Oh my god, Astarian, what are you gonna say? You can't see. Uh, I don't need a reflection to know this looks fabulous. <laughs> Alright, what now? Alright, where's this door? Oh, here. Here goes nothing. A thief. Who tried to steal from Auntie? Now the good little pet guards my home. Oh. Let's see one of these masks. Oh, let's get all the masks. Oh, an hourglass? Time to press ahead. My gentle Lauren. He wished to know what was to come. Oh, well, uh, he's a little bit preoccupied now. You feel the barest hint of life from within the door. Come on, Doyle, you need to open up. Oh, fine. Um. <laughs> nope. What about you? <gasps> nope. Keep a blade close. What about you? <laughs> oh, damn it. Action, not reaction. Oh, what am I doing? I know this one. <laughs> Shit. Alright. Shoot it. Can you lockpick it? No, you can't lockpick it. You feel crushing waves of fear as the presence within the door recoils. It can't let people through. Not again. Oh, okay, I've got to go through this again. Appears in your mind. Two pal weapons brandish, they screams of terror. You let them in. The door stays silent. Its form flickers, and you realize that the door is transparent. 
Oh, great. I can see through you. I can just walk right in. You see the hag, eyes bright with glee as she sets fire to the door. Oh, shivers. With a jerk, you're pulled from the vision. The presence within shrinks, begging you not to run through it. Well, we're going to do it anyway. <laughs> How do we do that? I don't know. You feel the barest hint of life. You see the hat with a jerk. You're pl How are we supposed to get through? Looking ahead. All right, let's try laser. You feel crushing waves of fear. No time to chat. I'm here. Appears in your mind. Weapons, screams. You let them in. Nobody. Uh, That's it. The door twitches, but stays firm. If I kill the hag, you'll be free. Come on. Shit. All right, one more time. Let's go. Ooh, okay. You see the hag. She walks through the door, its form shimmering. The lightest touch of hope brushes your mind as the presence within retreats. Okay, walk through the door. You feel the barest hint of life from you see that with a jerk. Oh no. All's well that ends. Not as bad as it could have. Alright, well how how can I get through? I don't know how to get through. Hmm. Do I have to set fire to it? Let's see. Who's got a fire spell? Shadow My faith will guide me. Shadow Heart does. No. What the actual hell? This one? No. No. Um. Gosh, I don't know. I guess I'm gonna have to come back. Is there something in the room that I'm missing? Might as well. Oh wait, I haven't looked at these guys yet. Hmm. Let's see. A watery eye. This poor dear wished never to lay eyes on her family again. Damn. Breathing, despite everything. My dearest Efren, he begged me to halt the deadly disease that ravaged him. How much farther can I go? if I can like dip my weapon and attack I'm ready whatever it takes use every advantage right will it do something now time to meet your maker <gasps> oh yeah now waves of fear as the presence within the door record images for his cries for mercy oh. cut short as the hag slices into him oh. dismembering him painstakingly limb by limb she cackles the man's remaining flesh twisted and contorted becoming the twisted surface of the door before you ew flee you feel it cry I'm not afraid. A scene appears in your mind. Two pallid weapons brandished screams of Do you let them in? Nobody. That's a thing. You see an image of blue skies and sunshine as the door shudders a warning. Run. So Alright, so let's its form flickers, and you realize that the door is transparent. All right, let's go outside then and I'll see if we can 
see if we can come in from the outside. I don't really know do we have here? how we'll do it, but we'll just have to work it out. There was another little path. Uh, where do we go? This way. It was a little path down around here somewhere. Oh no. <laughs> Everything's all gross. I don't know if this is going to help us or not. Oh. This ribbit. That's that frog that I saw ages ago. I'd better do the talking. The frog's entire body shakes. It ribbits erratically as if in pain. Oh dear. Come here, it's all right. It shies away, croaking a warning, eyes wide in terror. Oh dear. Who's a good froggy? Don't worry, I'll leave you alone. Come when you're cold, you stupid frog. Who's a good froggy? Why are we... Why? High defense. With pleasure. Oh gosh. Oh, a crit though. Time to strike. He's only got six health, but he's going to be tough, is he? Yep, this is not going to go well. I don't have a despite everything. I don't have <laughs> I don't have high hopes for this one. Let's try this psionic power or whatever it is. Oh, I see. Okay. Good. Again. Oh, Daddy liked that one. <laughs> Come on, let's get him. Oh, I miss. Moving. Take your, your. Uh oh, we're we gonna die to a frog. <laughs> we are, aren't we? Oh, we got it. One XP. That old frog. Very well. So uh, this does not look good. Someone there. Why? What are you doing, Shadowheart? Have to keep pushing. Just go through. Come on, Lazel. Watch the shadows. So, um All right. I have no idea how to get into Ethel's home. So, we are going to Goblin camp is there. Let's go up this big street here. Or this big, whatever that is, the big path there. I don't know how to get through here. It's probably a freaking booby trapped. Where's the best fast travel place? Um, we could go here and then we could get, there were like the knolls there, weren't there? Up near that place. Let's do that. Let's go and get the gnolls. Oh, 
we go, then. Off we go, indeed. Let's go. Oh, a knoll crawler. Let's go here. Let's take a starry and if this isn't important, not a sound. out of the party. What have we here? Sneak attack on him. Like literally everybody and their mom is now Not one false move. <laughs> is now going to uh, attack us. Out of the shadows. Yeah, let me get her. Oh, we got it. Crit. That was sick. The dance macabre. All right. So do I have to? Oh, I've got a lot of advantage on this one. Let's get him. Oh, we got a crit. Didn't even need to frickin' roll my dice. Mm. Let's, move. Let's just stay up here for now. Oh, God, I'm not in invis anymore. That's all right. We'll stay here. And then we can shoot. Oh, Smox isn't. This count as adventuring. Smox isn't in combat yet. <laughs> oh, mate, we are gaming. <laughs> uh, Smox, maybe go up here. Ready. Cloak and dagger. My favorite. Yeah, Shadowheart, why don't you do something similar? Oh, a seven. That was pretty good. Mm. Yeah, let's shield Lazel. Yeah, I reckon jump down, Lazel. What's this thing? Sacred munitions. Infuse your crossbow bolts with holy energy. Oh. Let's do this one. And let's attack this guy. Oh, you break. Oh, you freaking missed, honestly. Oh, nice one, though. Now to keep going. Oh, they're all surprised. That's why. That's quite good. Who is this? Oh, shivers. 85. <gasps> Lazel's going to get a bit screwed up there, I have a feeling. Sorry, I need to get down there. Lucky they've got all that bonus health. Let's try to get the big guy. Let's go for a crit. Nice, we hit him for 29. That's pretty good. I'm gonna jump. Oh, minus nine HP, I'm not gonna jump. <laughs> Dash. Let's head down here. On the way. Mm. 
All right, Lazo. <laughs> Mate. Victory awaits. Yes, it does. Okay, you are going to cleave is five to thirteen. Sweeping is one to eight. Let's do cleave. Beautiful. So the high end is almost done. So, oh, a crit on her. That's no good. Who are these guys in here? And are they fighting or no? No, I don't think they are fighting. Okay, so we need a big heal on... Big heal on Lazel. A big heal for four. Woo! That's the best healer in the world right there. <laughs> All right. Uh, where's the guy that had like four health? That one. Great. Okay. At least that's one gone. I'm going to try to use my body to well. block... Block them, I think. If that makes sense. At least if they're, I'm right next to them. They might not try to get the others, perhaps. I don't know. That's my thinking anyway. Let's bless our party. Okay, heal for seven. Not bad, not great. <laughs> Missed, awesome. Oh, was that a vampire bite? All right, Starian. 85. Let's go for... Let's go for this guy and then maybe Shadowheart can finish it off. Oh, hell yeah. That was awesome. Let's go for the bite on the big guy. Nice. I am fury. I am death. Let's try to just take out this hyena. Come on. Beautiful. Make way. Where are you going? I meant to walk right next to you. Sorry. That was just a misclick on my behalf. Oh, that's all right. Let's go and take care of these guys. Oh, not enough movement. All right. That's fair. Time to push my luck again. Oh, he's only got three health. Oh, hell yeah. And then let's just heal us all. Nice. Uh, let's go up here. Oh, yes, he missed. Nice. All right, you finish him. Oh, for seven. That's exactly what we needed, Shadowheart. Um, let's heal Astarian. Beautiful. Let's go stand down here. Oh, I miss. That's awesome. Oof. Oh, jeez. Who have we got? Astarian? Okay. Let's try this out. Your attacks deal an additional damage, but I take damage too. But let's just try it out, I reckon. Yes. Excellent. Oh, Daddy likes that one. Oh, a crit miss. Nice. Very good. 
<laughs> you bow. Oh, you Mate, she got it done. Alright, cool. Let's go back and take care of this other guy. Beautiful. Nothing will stand in my way. I'm sure of it. Uh, let's do dissonant whispers on this guy. I wonder if this will work. It's only 40. Oh, he's frightened for 16. Jesus Christ. What was that? That was awesome. Let's finish this. Right. Hit him. Ooh. Nice one. Ooh. Okay. Let's see how much damage we do. Oh, 13. That's pretty good. And we've got an offhand. Which is in my offhand. Maybe I should soften them over. Oh, I can't while I'm in combat. Whatever. I am fury. I am I'll try it for the next one. Ew. There's a parasite in that corpse. Oh! Brimming with potent. By the oh, gods. hello. Who are you? You're a sweet sight. Thank you. Are any of my crew still alive up there? Uh. Oh, they were the guy around the tier where the tier are uh, hanging out. No, it's a grim sight. This whole journey's been one grim sight after another. Gnolls, goblins, drow. Risen roads more dangerous than ever. You're the first friendly face we've seen since Eltergard. Eltergard? Eltergard's a long way from here. Where are you heading? Uh, I'll stay friendly so long as you hand over all of your goods. <laughs> Where are you heading? We're bound for Baldur's Gate. Got some cargo to deliver. But we've a stop to make along the way. Where's that? Maybe I should come so you don't get waylaid again. What are you transporting? What are you transporting? Trinkets for some rich tosser in Baldur's Gate. He gets his, I like his shiny gear. baubles. We get a handful of Terenths. <laughs> shiny baubles. Terenths are the currency of a merchant network called the Centaurim. Led by the mysterious Paragost of Darkhold, their dealings are far from scrupulous. Oh. Darkhold was getting concerned. I've been sent to retrieve the shipment. <laughs> Whatever your cargo is, I'll take it in payment. A lot of people died for those baubles. Your Zentarum. Your people don't deal in baubles. I'm going to say whatever it is, I'll take it as payment. Oh my god, I won. Shit. Can we roll again? <laughs> no, we can't. If I lose that cargo, my people will do worse to me than the Knowles would have. And you think I won't? Bloody fool! May the black hand take you! Why well, are we fighting now? We are, it looks like. Well, hello. So let's hide. Oh. No, they already know I'm here. Not enough movement. All right, that's fair. No time to waste. Ollie and Rugen. Oh, how freaking dare you! Christ. Nice. Nice. Over here. Oh, that's right. Uh, oh, can't do it in combat. <laughs> it's so funny how he runs. Oh, I forgot to change back to my bloody uh, me a melee weapon. Huh. 
What does that big gnarl have on them? <gasps> A shattered flail. Oh god, okay. I don't know about that. Oh, that's the Mind Flayer Parasite. Nice. Onward. Oh. Wait a second. Where did he go? Oh, did we kill him already? Must have. Fuck yeah. All right, let's move this. Where's the starion? I'm going to change that good dagger to the offhand and see, see if that makes a difference. There's all sorts of stuff here. Don't mind if I do. An unusual chest. The sort that holds more than just a few worthless baubles. Here we go. So, what are we waiting for? Let's crack it open and see. You did a great job. Ooh, pink and leaf green dye. That sounds awesome. Gold and the iron flask. A glowing flask. Huh, that's weird. I wonder who knows about that. All right, I think we should rest at camp before we get into any more bothers. Still alive. So that's progress. I need a moment for the two of us. Oh, that's a different bit of dialogue. It's always a pleasure to see you sauntering over. Hassan looks a little bit naked. No, he's not there. <laughs> Everyone, don't get excited. Oakfather's blessings to you. Oh, God, there's a lot. I have to ask, how do you know so much about the parasite? I studied one up close. Closer than most would care to be to those things. A drow attacked me and I defended myself. Afterwards, I was able to examine the tadpole that emerged. Hideous, but fascinating. Like nothing else in nature, I'm glad to say. Okay, why do you want to go to Moonrise Towers? At the celebration with the tiefling before, I hope I didn't come over too strong. Got caught up in the moment. <laughs> there are few things that are too strong for me. And cast those regrets aside. You did not get caught up in the moment. You seized it. In other circumstances, I would have done the same. Oh my god, Halson, are you flirting with me? <laughs> would have done the same? I'm glad I didn't leave a bad impression. Honestly, let's just forget it. Would have done the same? Perhaps. But best to not dwell on nights past. There are plenty more yet to come. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> How are you faring at the camp? With such stimulating company? <laughs> Never better. I think I might be sick beyond the tadpole. I'm getting worried. Oh God, do I want to be that honest? Everything in your mind has been destroyed from what I gathered. And from the path I see you on, you are doing well at picking up the pieces. I am here to be your ear as you bear your burdens and the arms that protect you if you can shoulder them no more. I believe you when you tell me that your symptoms do not wholly align with the makings of the parasite. Wow. But until we remove it, I doubt we will be able to isolate the rest of your troubles. Hmm. Sleepwalking, illuminate, hallucinating, the temptations. I could lose myself before I make it. The Oak Father must have blessed you to make it this far. Or, 
Another eye above? If I had my fleet of druids and a month of hard research, perhaps I could help. But I'm no savant. For now, I can only guarantee a cure for seromorphosis. Those illithid creatures threaten the natural order. It's my duty to do what I can to stop them. There's also the Shadow Curse. It's an affront and must be cleansed. I helped overthrow Ketherick Thormund his dark justicias years ago. But I failed to prevent him from unleashing darkness across the region before he was defeated. If I can join you and get close to Moonrise, perhaps I can lift this curse just as you find a cure for your infection. Hmm, okay. Seems like you feel responsible for the Shadow Curse. Do you know how the Shadow Curse can be stopped? Is that why you went with Aradin? You thought he might find a route to Moonrise? Precisely. Then perhaps I could have done something about both the Shadow Curse and Seromorphosis aberrations. But in my eagerness, I put far too much faith in the abilities of Aradin and his band. We didn't even get close. No, you literally just left the grove. <laughs> Seems like you feel responsible. Well, there's hardly anyone left to share the responsibility with. Few who witnessed the fall of Moonrise still draw breath. What Ketherick Thorm unleashed is not something that nature can undo by itself. I must do what I can. I studied the Shadow Curse for years, but to truly understand it and stop it, I must reach its source. Do you know how the Shadow Curse Perhaps. can be stopped? But we'll need to get closer before I can put my theory into practice. Put it from your mind for now. Once we near the curse, then there will be more to be said. Okay. All right. Mate, that was a good talk. Let's talk to Gail. Not over. Then, through. then we can end the day. Go ahead. I'm listening. I miss having you around, Gail. I think you should take ah, Shadow Heart's place. Nothing would give me greater pleasure. Which of our esteemed company am I stepping well, in? Or maybe Lazel. Let's get rid of Lazel for a little while. Back in the thick of things at last. Oh, how exciting. <laughs> Nauseated, vulnerable to psychic and acid damage until next long rest. Hmm, that's interesting. So, do you have loves waiting for you once this is all over? You know what? That is not the easiest of questions for me to answer. Oh. You mean just waiting? Like a lovesick puppy? <laughs> Short-term amusements are much less hassle. <laughs> I love it. Moving ahead. All right, so we're gonna go continue into the rest of the wargs. Is that right? Always room for I think more. that's what's gonna happen. There's blood down there. I think we've taken care of those wargs, though. I'm not exactly sure. What's over here? Oh, there's like a town. Oh. More wogs. Right, let's swap to a Starian. Let's do a sneak attack on... No, can't do him. Why don't we hide? Quietly. And then we'll do a sneak ranged attack. Put them all together. Can't you get any closer, mate? Path is interrupted. Let's try again. Here we go. Let's get him. Nice. Hit for us. Ooh. Then he got 7 out of 12, uh, 22 now. That's awesome. Oh, Gale is still tolerable. Tolerable. Gale. Ooh. Why don't we try Cloud of Daggers? Yes. Look at this. Let's go. I've never cast a spell before. Oh, that is awesome. All right, who else? Oh, Smox is in the shadows. Light on my feet. Oh, she's very much in the shadows. What can she do? Uh... <laughs> Not heaps. Um... That was quite good, actually. 
If she had some kind of way to like ensnare them in there, that would have been even better. Well, you know what? Let's just go with a piercing shot on that guy. Oh, I forgot he had the portent dice. Mm, I'm not going to react. I don't think we need it. Oh, that was a crit. All right. Yes, let's. Oh, my God. Astarian. Too hot to handle. Okay, not enough movement for that, but we can do this one. 11, 12, 12. Let's go for mystery 11. Nice. So easily taken care of. Mm, I will move down here. With finesse. I wonder if those daggers will actually attack, uh, not attack, but get the Starian. I don't know. Oh, a miss. That's nice. Okay, Smoxie, what are you going to do, matey? Oh, they're dead. Wow, that is good. Best be on my way. Is that not good? I reckon that's awesome. That did quite a good job. What should I do? Shadowheart, can you reach that guy? Damn. Uh, can you... Get him with a spell? No, okay. Just move faster. I mean, move closer. <laughs> move faster. Well done. Oh, you can reach now. Oh, a seven. That was awesome. The dice roll in my favor. The, I hope the dice roll in your favor too, my darling. Good move. All right, Astarian's going to absolutely just shred this guy. Delicious. Yes. That was sick. Oh, it does. You do take damage. Get out of it. Everybody, you idiot. Get out of it. <laughs> what else do we have? I can still hear dogs. Okay, there's hyenas down there too. Let's leave them be. You seem to know a good deal about our condition, Gail. Everything, really. Not to put too fine a point on it. <laughs> a humble specimen, aren't you? On occasion. On my next playthrough, oh. definitely romancing Gail, 100%. <laughs> I don't know what would be the best to like compliment Gail because I'd want to have him in my party all the time so maybe I could have like a cleric or something and then just not have Shadowheart in the party that could be fun welcome to Joaquin's rest west Baldur's Gate east Elturel. Joaquin's rest. Oh, mountain pass. Smoke. Something's burning. That doesn't sound good. Oh my gosh, everything's burning. He of the unsleeping eyes. Grant me the might to carry this burden. Grant me the faith to face darkness without fear. Oh dear. What the hell's happened here? Looks like he wasn't cut out for this line of work. My condolences to you. What happened here? A massacre. Drow and goblins slaughtered the lot. Please, just leave me be. Okay. Is this the place that the goblins were like bragging that they took all the beer or something from? I hear shouting. Someone needs help. Drow craft armor. No magic left though. Sun's too bright. Drow. They're the underground. Oh, I almost stole from that. Tempers are oh. rising. 
It's clear not everything you find is at your disposal. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to. Teachers care when we would be reckless. Teachers certainty when we would have doubt. We'll never put this fire out. You're better off helping anyone trapped inside. Okay. Who's inside? Oh my god, I could set off I could attack the fire wine barrel. I don't think that's a good idea. Looking ahead. Let's go my way. Graduate Raven Guard could be inside. Don't just stand there. Push! Grand Duke Oh gosh, performance. We can do it. Put your backs into it. Push. Yes, we're going that one. Oh. <laughs> Alrighty. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. Three, two, one. Push. Go and Smugs get in there. Oh, she kicked the door down. <laughs> Inside. Love Hurry. that smug look. We don't have much time. Inside. Uh, is that a good idea or? Stay where you are. We don't have much time. Find out. Find who? Who am I finding? I'm trapped. Oh, I'm blinded. Sorry, just thought I'd do some quick looting, you know, but maybe it's not a good idea. <laughs> All right, fine. H who's yelling? Have I missed them? Which door? Opening it could spell trouble. This door? Oh, I can't move. Oh! Where did my turn go? <laughs> I love that. Smox is just like, opening it could spell trouble, and I'm like, move aside. Oh, shit. Can I go through it all or no? A broken door. Can I attack that? I think so. Oopsie, that, that's not the one. I'm trying, I'm trying, I'm trying. Oh. Let's go, Benren, go. go. Can you jump or? Yeah, we can jump. Bit of fire, never hurt anyone. <gasps> oh, shite. Um. So about rescuing you. <laughs> I think we uh, did not do the right thing. <laughs> I'm trapped. All right, I'm coming. Wait. Council Floric. More for me. All right. Um. Oh well, I feel very bad about that young man I couldn't save. Let's go, guys. So if I hadn't have opened the door, he probably would have lived. All right, guys, come on. Stop being, stop complaining so much. There's a water barrel. We made it outside, guys, you're okay. Fresh air, at last. Your boldness is a blessing. I'm in your desk. Well, thank you. Counselor, are you all right? It takes more than mere fire to break me, Yuva. Now listen close, Fist. Duty calls. Drow have taken Grand Duke Alder Ravenguard westward, if my eyes and ears can be believed. Gauntlet, report to the manor and send for reinforcements. We must find the Duke. 
on your command, Councillor. The rest of you, count the dead. Take word of their sacrifice to this city. And you, I must ask again for your aid. Please, rescue Ravenguard from his drow captors. The council will reward you for your effort. Okay. May I trust you'll see it through? I mean, sure, we just met, but sure. <laughs> uh, oh, God, there's so many options. Why entrust this to me? You have others. The Absolute Cult is based at Moonrise Towers. That's where they'll have taken the Duke. Who is this Duke? Ravenguard. I know that name. He is much loved by the city, isn't he? I owe no fealty to some upper city toff. <laughs> I'll rescue you, Duke, Grave, uh, Duke Ravenguard. You have my word. So wh why would you entrust this to me? By the time aid arrives, it might be too late. You've the heart of a dragon and the will of a hero. Tell me I can count How on How does she know? I mean, it's true. I am awesome. The Absolute's cult is based at Moonrise Towers. That's where they'll be. Moonrise Towers, along the old road. That place is cursed. Few could survive there, unless darker forces are at work. This was no random attack. The Grand Duke was their target. Because we're heading there anyway, so... Uh... Yeah, all right, we'll find him. Thank you. And should your courage falter, Remember the Duke's generosity. Approach the towers with care. The land itself has been swallowed in shadow. I will seek reinforcements and join you when I can. Fist to work. Oh. Uh, what? What have we got? We learned that the Grand Duke was captured by Drow and taken westwards. You receive the Sparky Points, Electric Blood. When the wielder sister Trident, when the wielder deals damage using this weapon, they gain twi oh, they gain two lightning charges. Oh my gosh! Ooh, the Jolt Shooter, three to ten damage, Electric Blood. When the wielder deals damage using this weapon, they go to they gain two lightning charges. It's a long bow, and then a quarter staff. Oh, this would be really good for Gale. When the wielder gains deals damage with a spell or cantrip, they gain two lightning charges, main hand only. Where is Gale? Ah, excellent choice. Oh, zero to seven. So it does the same as Gale does. Gale's weapon does already. No, I think I'm gonna go the the. What's next? Quite ready for the quad the quarter stuff. What's next? I wonder. I think. You have my attention. To get the two, lightning charges, instead of the transmutation spell. Let's go. Beautiful. Ooh, it's quite nice. Ah, uh, let's move deep and move. Keep going. Oh dear. No traps, please. Oh. oh. The ox tenses. Horns lowered in your direction. Oh dear. <laughs> Interpret the behavior. Come on, just needed. Oh, a one. <laughs> oh no, let's roll again. Come on. There we go. Oh god, a crit failed to a crit success. His hide twitches, every muscle primed to bolt. He's terrified. Poor little guy. Hold out your hand. The ox calms, his tail swishing a satisfied arc. Something's moving around in there. Moving around in there? 
In where? Oil barrel. <gasps> oh. You spot a man crouching between the shelves, just as he spots you. Bugger! Bugger! Wait, listen. Read his mind? Wait, listen. Oh shit, a one. Oh dear. Burn, bastard! No! Oh crap! Please help me. Why did you run in? Uh, Stop it! Please. You help yourself. Oh god. Uh Oh. Oh dear. with us <laughs> oh dear let's go back to camp then eh <laughs> oh wait shivers can I resurrect anyone as shadow heart I'm not sure that I can I'd better do the talking ah Another, I shall be here in thy camp, for whenever thou hast need of my services. Be assured. I need to resurrect people. Very well. Um. As thou desire. I don't really want to do this, but I'm just trying to get him to open the dialogue how do you go back fate dost thou require a new ally yes a resurrection oh, then thou must return with the proper payment i want to resurrect all of my fallen companions this there is we the go price of balance well counted here we go. Beautiful. Oof. I was worried for a bit there. <laughs> oh, we've leveled up. Let's level up smocks. That's awesome. Okay, so... Class feature. Font of inspiration. You regain all bardic inspiration after a long or short rest. Plus one day eight. Oh no, I gotta choose a spell? Oh dear. Let's try the plant growth spell. That sounds kind of good. May as well leave our camp. We'll go back to where we were. The others must be close to leveling up then. Part of the flock. Auntie Ethel welcomes you, dearie. Whispering mask. Oh god, I'm a little bit afraid to equip that mask. <laughs> See. Oh god, there's a hatch. So where's this guy? Is he here or no? No. Should we go through the hatch? Oh. Where are we? down here. I wonder where it's coming from. A breeze, you say? Why would there be a breeze? Oh, there's a key. An engraved key. What does that open? Oh, there's a wardrobe. Chrissy always inspires ingenuity. What? A hidden stairs. All right, hang on. Let's see. Is there anything else here? 
That was like way too easy to find. Let's go. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. Wait. Zentarim hideout. Oh, this was the place that the guys were saying that they were working for or something that we killed near the um what's it called? Um the the knolls. Alright, awesome. Thanks so much for joining me everybody. My name is Smarks from Celebrant Quest. Please like the video and uh, subscribe to the channel and I will see you in the next episode of Baldur's Gate 3. Thanks everyone. Take care. Bye.